Hey guys, what's going on? So I'm going to talk a little bit about Notre Dame leaving the ACC and get some people's thoughts on it. Now, I personally thought Notre Dame was just doing this for one year and then it was officially announced today that they are not going back to the ACC. They will become an independent. Now, I'm sure a lot of ACC fans are going to throw things out there like, ah, yeah, Notre Dame's leaving because they don't want to play Clemson and they can't come in the ACC and and things like that but I'm gonna tell you right now if you look at Notre Dame schedule for 2021 that is not the case it is not so I'm looking at it right now and this schedule is brutal now it's not Notre Dame's fault if some of these teams are down but historically looking at things could you imagine playing this schedule Florida State Purdue Wisconsin Cincinnati Virginia Tech USC North Carolina Navy Virginia, Georgia Tech, and then closing the season out at Stanford. That is about as good as you can get as far as a just challenging schedule throughout the year goes. Now, I know some of these teams aren't what they used to be, but there are still very good teams on here. Cincinnati, they have an opportunity to go out and prove something to the world if they could pull an upset with no, against Notre Dame. We don't know what Cincinnati's going to look like because Marcus Freeman has left Cincinnati and he's actually going to Notre Dame, filling that position left behind by Clark Lee, who's taking the Vanderbilt job. So I think that it's going to be pretty interesting to see what Notre Dame does this year. I'm not so sure that they'll make it into the playoff. I mean, they've been in there a few times and they've not had any luck. They've been pretty much destroyed every time. But the thing is, is I don't think you can... I don't think this schedule is any easier than if you were playing an ACC schedule. I mean, besides Clemson, I mean, you got North Carolina, who probably isn't going to be what they were last year. They're losing a lot of talent, and they're losing their running backs coach, who went to Alabama, who, let's be real, that offense was centered around, around what those running backs could do. And, I mean, I do think they have a good coordinator at North Carolina, but I just don't expect them to, ha to replicate the success they had in 2020. So I'd like to get your thoughts on it. Do you think this is going to be, uh, do you think this was a move simply to avoid playing a team like Clemson? Or do you think that the, ch the schedule I just read to you could actually be more challenging than if they were in the ACC and had to play that schedule? Now, please like and subscribe to my videos. I'm just getting started and any type of support you could provide me would be greatly appreciated. I appreciate you guys tuning in and we'll talk to you later.